everyone, so today I'm going to be doing my November favorites, but before I say anything, I got a new camera and I am super excited because I have like HD quality now. It's, again, I wanted to say that I stutter a lot and I forget what I'm thinking because um, I'm ADD and OCD, so I'm sorry because I just stutter a lot. I have like speech impeppermint, I think. It was in a book and it said something I want to show you guys is my skincare products and the first thing is the Clean and Clear Deep Action Exfoliating Scrub and what this does, it um, gently exfoliates to clean deep down to the pores and I heard like the scrubs like, like remove all of your dead skin cells which is kind of good because you don't want to you don't want to keep those dead skin scales because they're not good really good so um, I really like this it just cleans all of my skin I just feel like it refreshes it and I use this three to four times a week which is not too bad because um, you don't really want to exfoliate every day because you can have like red, red skin I guess but um yeah I just been really liking this um, then I have my proactive advanced blemish treatment I actually use this um, when I lost my cleaning clear one and I really like that cleaning clear because it has benzoyl peroxide too but um, this one it is I think it works the same this this one and the clean clear one. I think it works the same. Um, I use this one, I take it and I put it like right here, then I use a cotton swab and then I take um, and I just put it on my um, imperfections and like my like my acne. And you don't want to put it on the skin that doesn't have acne because this can cause acne too, which is kind of weird though, but um, yeah. I now moving on to makeup products. I don't have many. I have about like three, I guess. But the first thing I want to show you guys is my concealer. And I haven't been wearing that much makeup lately. Like, um, I haven't been wearing like any foundation, tinge moisturizer. I've just been using this, like just concealer, um, throughout the, um, throughout the, uh, month. And this is the Rimmel Match Perfection 2-in-1 Concealer and Highlighter. And my shade is in Fair to Light. And this is actually my second bottle. And I haven't opened it yet. But my first bottle that I'm using right now, it's kind of, doesn't look too good. So I'm just showing you guys this one right now. And I really like it because this one is a concealer plus a highlighter. So I just, um, actually don't use it as a highlighter. But um, I'll try next time. I'll see how it works. But um, yeah, I've been really losing, really loving this for concealer. I have two lip products and the first thing I want to show you guys is a lip balm and you guys know I love lip balm so much. I love smooth lips. Um, and now it's getting close to winter. I think it's winter already. It's December. Um, my lips get super dry so I always have to like use a lip balm or a lip product to like moisturize them and I've been using this one and oh my gosh guys the scent of this is so amazing. This is Chapstick Candy Cane and I think this is limited edition because they also have apple cider and like a chocolate souffle one but my favorite scent for Christmas time is peppermint and I don't know I've just been loving this one a lot lately. It's clear obviously. And, I don't know, it smells super yummy. I have this L'Oreal Paris lipstick in Tropical Coral. Um, this is what it looks like. Now, um, it's not like your typical, like your, it's like an obvious coral. It has like a red-pink mix to the coral. And I'll swatch it for you guys to see. Like that. And it's really buildable too. And I'm wearing it right now and it's kind of sheared out. But um, this is like a really buildable color. Like you can like wear it out and bold it up a bit. Now moving like on to nail polish. Um, I only have nail one nail polish. I haven't worn a lot of nail polish this month. But this is the only one that I've been wearing. I wore this about like two times and I really like it. This is the Oily Nail Lacquer in Calypso Breeze. And I'll show you guys too real quick. It's so beautiful. It's like a mid-tone blue but has a little bit more deeper tone to it. And it does have like a bit of shimmer. A bit of like shimmer to it. I don't know. I don't think you can see though. But um, I actually took it off my nails like two days ago. So I can't show you guys it. But um, I just really like this color. It's so beautiful. And it's really good for winter and stuff like that. And then the next thing I have to show you guys is a candle. Obviously I've been loving candles so much during the fall and winter season. And this is a Ginky candle. And it's a home classic one. And it's in black cherry. Now um... If you, if you would want to get this and you don't really like cherries, I don't think that you would really like it because, like, my friend, she, she hates cherry, like, she hates, like, the smell of cherries, like, artificial cherry, but I feel like this is, like, an artificial cherry, but a little bit sweeter, 
and I love the smell of artificial cherry or like cherry medicine. If you don't like cherry medicine, I don't think you will like this candle. But if you like cherry like me, um, then you'll obviously like it. So yeah, I really like this candle. And I got this in the beginning of November. And see, look how much I burned. It. It's crazy. Oh my god. Beauty favorites. I have two food products for you guys. Because I've been eating a lot of food lately. Like like junk food and stuff. Which is not good because I'm usually I'm a person who would eat healthier. But I've just been eating a lot of bad food this um, month. But um, yeah. So the first thing I want to show you guys is this cereal, and this is limited edition too, guys, so this is really special. Um, this is the Marshmallow Pebbles cereal, and look look what it says right there. It is limited edition, so you guys, go to your stores, go to Target, go to Walmart, go anywhere, go to any store that sells food, and go find this in your cereal aisle, cereal aisle and I pro I'm pretty sure they'll have the marshmallow. And I don't know, I just been in love with these, love with these, and they're super yummy, they're just so good. And then my last um, non-beauty favorite is hot chocolate. Oh my gosh, but not just hot chocolate, peppermint hot chocolate. I've just been in love with this. Oh my gosh, it's so, so yummy. It's really good. Oh my gosh, and plus, it's getting really colder where I live, and I don't know, this is just like, it makes my day because it's just so yummy, it's sweet, it's chocolate, and it has like a hint of peppermint and I will make like a vlog on how I make my peppermint hot chocolate for you guys so if you if you wanna if you wanna look for that um I will make it soon and put it in my vlogs and I'll just put that in and now moving on to my favorite songs of the month I've been listening to much so much Korean pop um I'm, I'm obsessed it's crazy like I can't stop listening to it but um yeah so the first thing the first song that I've been loving so much is EXO and there's like a 12 member group but they're like subdivided so there's like six each XOK and XOM and I've been loving um Loving well, actually, it's a band. I have been loving Big Bang, and oh my gosh, I love them so much. At first, I didn't really like them, but um, after hearing the music countless of times on repeat, I actually like their songs. Um, I fit, my two favorites that I've been loving for them are Bad Boy and Blue. But the weird song that I actually kind of like is Fantastic Baby, and the musical music video is actually kind of weird too. But um, you guys should search it up. It's kind of weird. <laughs> Fantastic baby. So um yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed my November favorites video. Um I'm actually really happy that I got a better quality camera. But um yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed it and I will see you guys soon. Bye guys!